teach you how to assemble the Master 3X FPV drone. First, we'll mount the four drone arms. Please tighten their screws. Then install the aluminum posts columns. Locate the TPSIC interface on the AIO and solder the ribbon cable. This cable can be found in the frame accessories. Install the all-in-one AIO flight controller onto the FPV drone frame. Next, install the four FPV drone motors properly. We are now conducting pretinning on the power supply solder joints with the soldering temperature set to 450 C. In soldering capacitors, note that the longer lead is the positive terminal. Now let's print in the motor pads. Note that the temperature should be adjusted to 350 C. If the soldering is insufficient, you can apply flux to help the solder flow faster and better. The installed wire harness board for the motor helps with cable routing. Cut the motor wires to the appropriate length, strip the insulation with wire strippers, then pretend the wires. Then solder the motor wires one by one. Be sure to solder quickly, otherwise the flux will evaporate and make soldering difficult. Of course, you can also apply more flux past to just remember to clean it afterward. Then, solder the receiver, noting that the TX port of the receiver corresponds to the RX port of the flight controller AIO and the RX port of the receiver follows the same principle. This is a common mistake beginners make, which can prevent the drone from starting up. Install the receiver on the cover plate and tighten the screws. Then we install the side guard plate and the cover plate, and that's it. ETEX can be directly plugged in using 04 wiring, but since 04 requires an additional purchase here, it will not be installed for now. Let's take it for a test flight now. It feels great light and easy to handle, perfect for beginners.